Well, good morning, YouTube, and welcome back to Retired for Life. I'm your host, Brian, and let's get back to the job. So this is our fourth full day working on the siding. So we're making some really good progress today. The bottom boards are in, and we have started putting up our vertical boards. So that's a really big step. So I've tried to do something about the heat, which is why I've got this canopy up. This at least gives me a little bit of room where I can step back out of the sun under the shade of the canopy where I've got my mobile workbench located. And that is helping quite a lot. So between this job and all the haying that I'm still doing uh, with my neighbor, it has been a very busy time. But progress is being made. So let's have a look at the job. So as you can see, we're getting some boards up, finally. I've used up the few that I had stained already from a previous job. So we're back to uh, unstained boards, and that's fine. We're gonna stain them after. But one big change I wanted to tell you about, I've been using the generator here for powering my uh, hammer drill. And I've decided because of the amount of cuts that I have to do, I just brought my miter saw out here. And I was thinking that, all right, I can just power it with the generator. But then Amazon Prime Days came along. So we're gonna switch from this to this. 
So I will do a full review on this in a later video. Now this was not given to me to try or anything like that. I bought this. So you're going to get a full honest opinion on what this thing does and how well it works. This is the uh, Blue T. I think that's how you pronounce it. AC180. So it has 1800 watts and I need something that's got some decent wattage because I want to run my uh, saw with it and other power tools so some of the little ones just won't cut that. So I will eventually build a really nice cradle to sit this thing in on my uh, portable workbench so I can just drop it in there and take it with me wherever uh, I'm doing a job and have instant power. So we are going to be uh, starting out by running my uh, DeWalt miter saw from this and we'll just see how it does. All right, let's get back to work. Hello YouTube, I'm your host Brian and welcome back to Retired for Life. So if you've been finding today's video interesting, or at least a little bit entertaining, I'd really appreciate it if you could give the video a like and share around and I'd love to have you subscribe to the channel. So thanks again and let's get back to work.
All right, well, it's the end of the day here, and we've been running this thing all day, cutting all these boards uh, and using my hammer drill to put screws in. And let's see what we've got left here. All right, so I have got 86%. So all this time that this thing's been running, we have not used that much power. And it's done perfect running the hammer drill and running the miter saw. There's been no trouble at all. So, so far, I'm quite pleased with this. Well, that's it for today's video. Thanks again for watching. And don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And I'd love to have you subscribe to the channel. So remember to be safe out there, be good to each other, and we will see you out on the trails the next time.